Like totally action, dude. <laughs> Greetings, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Timmy G's unboxing stuff. And stuff? Today, Mega Month rolls on as we are going to be unboxing our $25 what's in the box from don't eat the gum that's right if you don't know about don't eat the gum don't eat the gum is a mystery box service specializing in horror and sci-fi genres run by kevin kennedy unlike most of these uh, mystery boxes it's not a monthly thing it's not a subscription thing it's just whenever you want a box go on the website and you order there's a ten dollar box a twenty five dollar box a fifty dollar box and a hundred dollar box um, well there's actually two fifty dollar boxes but i'll explain <laughs> the uh, ten dollar pack is uh, the what's in the pack and that's pretty much you know you just get what what he sends you um which is mostly stickers and uh, retro trading cards and little things like keychains and bottle openers and really rad stuff uh, but then there's the $25 box so the $25 the $50 and the $100 boxes are completely catered to you you fill out the notes section with uh, movies that you're into shows that you love you can specify types of items that you do or don't want um, you know, he will work with you to make sure you get an awesome, awesome box. And it's not even necessarily limited to horror and sci-fi. And unlike the other catered boxes um, that we've seen in the past from other places, I'm not going to name names, but, you know, you don't have to sit and wait two, three months, uh, a year, you know, to get your box. Some of those places in, even ended up running off with people's money. You just... Pay for your box within a fill out the note section, like I said, within a, usually a two week window, you're going to get your box and it is going to be awesome, as you'll see as we get into the box. Um, and I want to specify that there's also a $50 uh, completely random box. If uh, you know you just want to get some random stuff and you don't necessarily want it customized to you, you just want to be surprised. Um, then there is that option. And also, also for beginners, uh, I think he started offering a $25 completely random box. Um, so you might want to check that out too. But I've done, you know, a ton of boxes from Don't Eat the Gum. Usually we do the $100 boxes, uh, as you'll know if you've been watching my channel. We do those every month. They're always awesome. They're always a home run. And, uh, you know, there's just never a disappointment. And usually with the $50 and the $100 boxes, there's also a uh, handwritten thank you note uh, that I suggest saving for the end of, uh, you know, the unboxing because sometimes he gives some spoilers away. So, uh, you know, to explain items. So if you want to keep it a surprise as you're going through the box, I suggest, you know, holding that for last. Um, but, you know, inside you're going to find a wide range of stuff from uh, toys, drinkware, retro trading cards, candy, uh, you know, stickers, uh, novelty stuff. There's, uh, you know, I think he even had some uh, Jason masks. I don't know if he still got those or not. But, you know, there's just a ton of, he's just got a ton of different stuff and things to send. Uh, so, you know, you'll see, obviously, an example of the $25 box right here. So let's not waste any time. As we always say, let's get up in Kevin's box. Timmy G's unboxing stuff and stuff. He's unboxing stuff and stuff. Please send me some stuff. So this is the first $25 box I've done in about a year uh we did this for mega month last year too and uh i think that that was the last time i got a 25 dollar or 50 dollar box uh i believe and uh we didn't get the uh 10 dollar pack uh this year but you know there's i've got oh i had got ordered so much stuff for mega month this year you know 
was just as you've been seeing and we've still got a few boxes to go including two more from don't eat the gum so when we open the box that's what you're gonna see or at least you're gonna see from my box and I already saw a big thing of Skittles <laughs> and that is awesome so here's a handwritten thank you note in the $25 box um, I don't think we got that in the uh, last $25 box uh, last year but that's an awesome awesome touch so right off the bat it looks like we've got a Michael Myers figure is this one of the yes it is this is a uh, Toonie Terrors Michael Myers so here we go here is the Toonie Terrors Michael Myers and uh, what company I'm not sure what company does these um, is it Oh, it's NECA. It says right on the front there. NECA. And NECA makes such awesome stuff. I love this little pumpkin that comes with it. That is awesome. And you can, uh, I don't know if you noticed here on the back, you can actually cut that out and make a little display uh, with him. So that is awesome. I might end up taking him out of the box because, uh, you know, these uh, figures aren't terribly expensive. Uh, and, you know, it's awesome. And so we're going to look at this uh, framed picture here. We got a framed picture here. Evil Dead 2. There's Evil Ash up in the mix. Obviously, behind the scenes, that that is awesome. Evil Dead 2 is one of the greatest, gotta be one of the greatest B-horror movies of all time. Uh, you know, in my opinion, hands down. You know, Evil Dead 2 is just <laughs> awesome. That is, well, I would have said it, it used to be the greatest installment in the entire Evil Dead franchise. But uh, now I think, I feel like Ash vs. Evil Dead uh, kind of retook that spot. Ash vs. Evil Dead was awesome. Um, but, you know, they're all awesome. So, there we go. That is fucking great. And we've got an art print right here. Let's see what we got this time. Uh oh, looks like we got a horrible home video print. And, ah, <laughs> That is awesome. We got the uh, Ernest Goes to Camp Crystal Lake. <laughs> that is awesome. That is. I wish. <laughs> I wish they could have made that into a real movie because that would be insanely crazy, wacky, stupid, and awesome. You know, that is great right there. And we have got a issue of Starlog creating Howard the Duck. That is awesome. And uh, let's see what else we got. The Ghostbusters return back to the Slime Wars. Special effects bonus inside the movie magic of Aliens. Uh, Indiana Jones. And uh, yeah. And uh looks like an interview with Chris Columbus, uh, inventor of the Gremlins. I don't know why I said that like a French accent because I don't think there was anything French in Gremlins, but that is awesome. A nice one to add to my collection. So we're down to the bag of goodies, and first I just want to show you we got a whole box <laughs> of Skittles Wild Cherries. And that is awesome because I love Skittles and I love the wild cherry. Uh, sour ones are my favorites, but the wild cherry and regular Skittles are fucking awesome too. I mean, how can you not like Skittles? And so we're just going to, well, I guess first we're going to actually open the goodie bag in our little bloody R.I.P. bag. And we're just going to dump it out on the table right here. 
So one thing at a time. First, we're going to look at these uh, unopened packs of cards here. Awesome. More Bernie Wrightson and the Macabre. Bernie, the Bernie Wrightson cards are just out of this world. And uh, let's see, we got some Mork and Mindy, Nanu Nanu. We got Tales from the Crypt. And we got the Blair Bitch Project. And Fright Flicks. That's awesome, too. And we got some uh, loose cards here. Well, card stickers, whatever you want to call them. Ah, more garbage pail, horrible uh, horror <laughs> parody garbage pail kids. I forget the exact name of the series, but you know what I'm talking about if you've seen them. So we got Blakeula. We got. <laughs> Cujo. We got ah, Branded Brewster. <laughs> yeah, we got oh, this is serial killers. Troll two, troll hundred or I'm not sure if that's supposed to be hundred or two, two like also two. Troll 2. <laughs> so that's great. And uh, let's see. We got a Lost Boys sticker. That is great. Call me crazy, but you know, I think the Lost Boys was one of the best vampire movies ever made. <laughs> you know, I enjoy those maggots, Michael. You're eating maggots, Michael. <laughs> and we got some more of these little card magnets. They're basically, they're uh, cards inserted in these little uh, hard cases with magnets on the back. So there we got what big teeth you have, Grandma. We got a Fangoria, the Exorcist Legion 3. And we got... Stay for coffee. And another Fangoria. Cellar Dweller. So that's awesome right there. And the rest of the goodie bag is candy. We got another thing of Skittles. This one is, uh, I don't know if I've seen these ones before. Surprisingly. This is Cauldron Skittles. I hope that this isn't those like mystery skittles like the uh, other ones were that had those nasty flavors <laughs> mixed in <laughs> no they're not these are just uh yeah we got oh one of my favorites laffy taffy of course i've got a lot of favorites when it comes to candy because <laughs> i like candy i like food and candy so there's that we got some Starburst, another one of my favorites, and another one of my favorites, Sour Patch Kids, and we got, ooh, a couple bottle caps, bottle caps, and finally, we got some fun dip, they're fun, and you dip them, they're fun dip. And lastly, we are down to that card, and uh, I forgot to mention, inside the card, there are usually cards and stickers, and, uh, well, cards and or stickers, <laughs> um, and obviously I can feel that there are, and uh, so we got Caution Timmy, stand at least 20 feet away at all times, and then we got a cute little couple babies on the back little baby couples and so before we read you the card we're gonna take a look at those cards inside the card and we got ah a little cyclist bear dude thing 
This looks like something off a of Rick and Morty almost. Then we got a Close Encounters of the Third Kind. And Garbage Pail Kids, Janet Planet. We got a Tales from the Crypt. For a minute there, he lost his head. <laughs> and there's a uh, Baseball's Greatest Gross Outs, Skinny Vinny. Skinny Vinny. Skinny Vinny. Skinny Vinny. Ooh, Bernie Wrightson. I recognize that artwork anywhere. Because only Bernie Wrightson is that awesome. And this looks like more Bernie Wrightson. And we got... Ha! Is that a banana in my hand? <laughs> That's a trip. Then we got a little astronaut skeleton dude <laughs> so that's awesome and uh before i zoom out and I actually read you the card here is the front of the card and there you can see there's writing inside for some reason it's, who would have ever thought timmy here is the 25 dollar box for mega month Thank you for making these videos, you wacky son of a... Anywho, that Ernest Goes to Camp Crystal Lake is a killer mashup from the brilliant mind of Justin Parker from Horrible Home Video. The Lost Boys sticker is from London 1888. Enjoy the box, and I can't wait to see the... <laughs> I can't wait till you see the next two. Take care, Kevin. Thank you, Kevin. <laughs> <laughs> so there we have it ladies and gentlemen i can't wait to see the next two either but you know this is awesome right here i love the toonie terrors michael myers that is gonna look awesome and uh the evil dead 2 picture <laughs> that is fucking great and the art camp uh the Ernest Goes to Camp Crystal Lake print. That was one of my favorite stickers I've ever gotten uh, from Don't Eat the Gum. And to, now to have the bigger art print uh, to put up on the wall, that is just flipping great. Even the big box of Skittles. I love my Skittles. So, you know, that is awesome. As you can see, even the cheap $25 box you would find $25 hiding in the couch cushions, you know? Even the $25 box is awesome. Uh, you know, the $50 box is even better, and the $100 box is even better than that. You know, uh, if you don't want to wait for my next videos, uh, you know, you could go back on my channel and watch. I've got like two years worth of $100 boxes, uh, you know, and I've got a few past... Uh, videos of $50 boxes. Point is, you just can't go wrong with Don't Eat the Gum. So in the coming weeks, obviously, uh, like we just said, I got two more boxes from Don't Eat the Gum yet. And uh, Daily High Club, uh, I think, just shipped today. Uh, so that ought to be coming relatively soon. Um, the uh, top shelf box from 420 Goodie Box ought to be shipping on the 25th. And uh, I think that those will be the last four officially for Mega Month. And then next month, we're going to have, uh, of course, we're going to have Fright Crate again. Uh, we'll have another $100 box from Don't Eat the Gum. I'm hoping to get some stuff from Nightmare Toys. We'll have Pro Wrestling Crate. Uh, it'll be a Hemper Month. Uh, yada, 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 yada. Uh, you know, next month won't have nearly as many, much stuff as this month has been. And will be but next month is gonna be awesome nonetheless so thank you all once again for tuning in if you like this comment subscribe and you know what i mean Vern. timmy g's unboxing stuff and stuff he's unboxing stuff and stuff please send me some stuff 
And then I'm going to shit all over these walls, Ray. Now that's what I call dirty talk. Volume 37. In case no one has told you today, butt cheeks. Butt cheeks, you guys. Butt cheeks. I don't got them. You know, I could be mistaken, but I think that fat guy really likes his stuff. And stuff. Hashtag fat guy. Because I'm smart. So in case I say some stupid shit, it just ain't enough oxygen going to my brain, man. One of the unspoken struggles of being fat is keeping the picture on my shirt centered. It always wants to, like, drift over to one side of my belly. Hey, like, ooh, I'm a fat guy over here. <sighs> Hand stuff. Action. Oh, action. Don't eat the gum is... <clears throat> the 25... There's a... Uh, um, I... You can... Does he make you horny, baby? Please take me to this Cleveland. All right, O. Ork, O. We got some cards, yeah. We packed the cards in Harvard Yards. <laughs> we got a Fangoria, the Exorcist Three Legion. Ooh, genius! It's brilliant. So thank you all one or wait, I gotta do uh uh that's that's it. Or shit. Cut.